the industry for 30 years. So, you know, that's one part. And the second part is that uh, uh, there are other, uh, you know, uh, opportunities in the north. Uh, like I mentioned, there are herbs. Uh, there are a lot of uh, other sort of products that have northern origin, uh, which are in sync with, uh, you know, the infrastructure that we have. So the vision was always to, you know, use one product, which is turmeric, to propagate ourselves in the market, to learn the industry, and then, you know, move ahead and add a larger bouquet of products. So that's a process that we started somewhere about two years back. Uh, for the first five years, we were primarily a turmeric only company. Within turmeric, we we found a certain capacity in manufacture because you know you don't want to be manufacturing more than what you could reasonably sell at good value. So um, that are able to achieve those numbers. Like I mentioned, the efficiency part of it. So what used to take us twelve months to do in two thousand and nineteen. The same amount of curcumin we are able to deliver in eight months now. So we've, you know, carved out a window in our production cycles where we are now able to explore other herbs. And uh, the ones we've gone for a lot of them, uh, the ones which we have successfully established are green tea, Sisters quadrangularis, berberin, which is going to go live uh, in this winter. So berberin is going to be a prime, another major product for us going ahead because it has a lot of synergy with curcumin. In terms of the way you have to handle the product, the way you have to manufacture the product, the issues of, you know, it can uh, cross contamination issues that we have already put systems in place to mitigate. So, berberin is also something that we have now in process. We have stabilized mm -hmm. the product and we are in process of introducing it commercially and should, should be able to do it by the end of the year.